praise the name of the lord shalom family once again you're welcome welcome to this amazing great awesome word and awesome session of course it's your friend and your sister dr irene and i pray a timely word from the lord i appreciate all those that you can read this particular word you always stop by whenever we do new video uploads returning viewers and returning subscribers god bless you amazingly in the name of jesus hallelujah praise the lord hallelujah glory to god in the highest now you will be amazed at what god showed me i saw them crying in their room saw them crying in their room and i saw them clashing with each other you know saw them clashing with each other and i had i heard them saying you made me do this you made me do this you made me do this <laughs> all you did was to love them all you did was to care for them all you did was to show them you know you treated them like a mother you treated them like a brother you treated them like a sister you did everything to draw clothes you knew you have lost your family and because they are close to you they are the only family that you have but despite all efforts to draw clothes despite all efforts you know even even all your your hard work all your efforts despite all of that the saw the star in you yeah they saw the star in you and they knew you were going to be great so they they decided to use torturing they decided to maltreat you in order to drain off the destiny and the bright future that god has put inside of you and that is why they were doing things the way they were doing they didn't treat you like any other child that was in the house they didn't treat you like their brother they didn't treat you like their sister they knew by maltreating you by torturing you by denying you some privileges by always underestimating you looking down on you it was going to drain you know all the the self-pride in you the self-confidence and you are going to let go but no you choose to face the strong wind of life with every strength that is inside of you and you know like the bible says in the book of first peter, first peter chapter 3 verse number 8 and 9 it says finally all of you be of one mind having compassion for one another love as brothers be tender-hearted be caution not returning evil for evil or revealing for or revealing for revealing but on the contrary blessing knowing that you were called to this that you may inherit a blessing hallelujah this is the scripture from which you are acting you decided not to pay them evil for the evil that they did but rather you have become a blessing to them <laughs> you become a blessing to them who says god doesn't answer prayers the same stone that was rejected now you are the chief cornerstone you're the one standing and carrying the entire family and i see this woman crying and saying ah i see this woman weeping i see this girl crying and saying ah we treated you so bad but rather you are showing us love you're, you're blessing us you're showing us kindness you know Sometimes they are confused. Sometimes when you even give them food to eat, they are scared. They are like, probably you have put something inside that they might eat and die because of the way they treated you, the way they even planned to kill you. But God says, vengeance is the Lord. Keep blessing them. Keep doing that which is good. And you will watch and see the salvation of the Lord. Vengeance is the Lord. As he has begun doing great things in your life, he will ride you into your fortune. He will ride you into your greatness. He will ride you into excellence. In the mighty name of Jesus. Now may the Lord bless you. Keep and cause his face to shine on you. May he cause his glorious, his gracious splendor to be displayed in your life. I love you so much and God bless you. Shalom.